Hi everybody, Bill here, if you didn't know. So, I think I need a haircut. Got a good mullet going on. No one will cut my hair during this coronavirus. I used to have a wonderful woman that would come over and cut my hair. Now she won't. She thinks I go out in public too much. <laughs> Anyways, oh yeah, how does Lisa do the opening? Welcome to our channel. Bill's in front of the camera, and guess what? Lisa is out back, I think, asleep in the sun. And you know what that means, right? So our weather has changed, and it's, uh, I think, 90, 92 degrees today outside. And that means Lisa is asleep in the sun. It's time to go soak her. Oh, were you probably listening to the air that whole time? <laughs> Someday I'll learn how to make a video. Let's go get Lisa. Okay, she's usually a pretty good sport about this, but her mood today... <laughs> I know I'm in so much trouble, but I'm going to do this anyways. Okay, let's go spy on her and make sure she's asleep. You get to see our dirty windows. It rains so much. We got to clean our windows. Oh, she's kind of moving around a little bit too much. She might be awake. This might not work. Let's go look over here. This one she might be able to. She's stirring. The creature is stirring. Okay. I'll give her a moment to fall back asleep. I saw her moving. So, how are you all doing today? Southern California starting to warm up. And the coronavirus is really making life fun, isn't it? All right, let's, um, oh yeah, we had to redo our, uh, whatever you call that over the sign glass door, the blinds or whatever. So I had to, I had to put the brackets up better. They were starting to pull out of the wall after five years of sliding that thing back and forth. All right, I want to go soak her. I want to do this. I warn her all the time. You fall asleep in the sun and burn yourself. I'm going to cool you off. Oh, it is hot outside. Maybe I should get shoes for my feet. Riley, is mama asleep? She's gonna hear me. The hose is all tangled up. Let me see if she can hear me. Hey, Lisa, are you asleep? <laughs> right, right, mommy leave you out here in the sun? Yeah, you're eating. Are you drinking too? He says, Dad, I'm a Chihuahua. My ancestors come from Mexico. Do you know how hot Mexico is? All right, let's see if we can do this. People are making noise. Don't go wake up Mama now. I don't see Oliver. I know he's outside in the shade somewhere. Okay. Let's do this. Oh my gosh, this is not gonna work today. <laughs> now how am I gonna get this much hose over there? Oh my gosh. This is gonna fail. Our grass is doing good. Oh, look at the knots in it. This isn't gonna work. Oh, I know she's gonna wake up. I'm not gonna have enough hose. Oh, you wanna know something? This water might be hot. Oh, I just thought of that. This water might be really, really hot. What if it burns her instead of freezes her? We're gonna find out. 
you've watched our videos in the past, you know I do this. What if she got her phone? Let's test this. Oh, it's hot. This is gonna be hot water. I'm not gonna hit her so close and the dog's there. Here we go. Oh, no kinks. No kinks in the hose. I turn it on and no water comes out. Well, at least it's gonna be hot water. But still getting wet. Let's see here. <laughs> How does she not hear me? <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's get the angle right. What's on her nose? Is it hot? It probably feels good. It's like... Is it hot? Come into it. Come closer. Oh. Is it hot? Put it down. Oh yeah. How about right there? No. Is it hot? It's, it's hot really water. Cold. Really cold. It, it was warm. It was really warm. But oh, it's cold, cold now. <sighs> Look at Riley ran. So you were, you, I didn't think you were that asleep because I looked out the window and you were moving the first time? Well, the dog kept kind of coming over and talking to me, but then like I would fall back asleep and... Where'd the cat? Is the cat, have you seen the He's cat? He's here. He was around just a few minutes ago. He and the dog were wrestling. Okay, I'm just, <gasps> it's just hot out today. It is, that actually, sorry, like, that kind of didn't go over the way you probably wanted because it kind of felt good. It surprised me, that, <laughs> but it kind of feels good at the same time. <laughs> so my video idea wasn't just this. Do you want to um, come inside and dry off a little bit and tell everybody what came to the door today? Sure. Okay. All right. Cut. Delicious. Cut, cut, cut. So after being so rudely awakened by, I guess it was warmish, coldish water, it really actually felt pretty good. And, you know, he does always say that I'm going to burn if I just lay out there. So I probably should be thankful for that nice spray down. But I decided I wanted to come in so that I could share with you what was delivered today. Somebody rang our doorbell and when we went to the door, there was a strange guy standing there with this bag. It's like a grocery bag. It doesn't say where it's from or anything. It just says, thank you for shopping with us in a reusable bag. And so he said, handed it to me and said, here's your delivery. And I said, okay, well, thank you very much. We have no note or anything like this. However, at the same time as this was delivered, we got a text message from our wonderful friend, Matt Nova. This is not for the kitty, no. Saying, that delivery that just arrived on your porch is from me. And in this, <laughs> it's, it's heavy. And in this bag is a giant bag of Peanut M&M's, but not just one. <laughs> Two giant bags of peanut M&M's and another share size M&M's. It is clear that Mr. Matt Nova, our dear, dear friend, watched our most re one of our most recent videos about not eating the last M&M in the bag. If you watched that video, you know that I did indeed, even after being instructed not to, I ate the M&M. And I actually felt really bad about it. And I'm not gonna do it again. So it may be really weird. We may end up with millions over the years. I mean, we eat a lot of M&Ms around here. And we may end up with just millions of bags with single last sole survivor M&Ms left behind. At least in these giant bags, we have a lot of deliciousness before we have to leave the very last one behind. These are party size. Unfortunately, we are not able to have a party right now. But these weigh two and a half pounds each. They could be my weights. And they are, oh my gosh, let's see how many calories. So, 
There are approximately 38 servings in this bag. <laughs> I doubt it, but there's 38 <laughs> servings in this bag. 140 calories per serving. That's a lot of calories. <laughs> About 5,000 calories per bag. After we received these, I was curious if um, there was such a thing um, about dying by eating too much chocolate. And technically there really is, but it's way more than this, especially because a lot of the weight that this consists of is peanuts. But we're very thankful for these M&Ms. Unfortunately, we can't invite all of you over to share our party size M&Ms, but I will tell you that Bill and I are going to be re going to be enjoying them. We're very happy. You to don't have like them. me coming in the shop? No. He says this is mommy. You don't video. let me come in the shop? What do you got? And then I'm so too hot Thank the you, shop. Matt Nova. Thank you, Matt. We miss you and we love you and we're so thankful for these delicious M&Ms that you had delivered directly to our door. You are what you eat. You're an M&M. I'm gonna be an M&M. I'd like one. I'm a green M&M. I want a yellow one. There's not one. Brown. All right, I'm not eating all these M&Ms. So it's delicious. Like, You're gonna spoil your dinner. That's right. All right, everybody. How is my dinner gonna be spoiled, Mom? Are you gonna leave it out too long? <laughs> not cook it well enough. All right, everybody. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give a huge thumbs up to our friend Matt Nova. He's so awesome. Such a good friend to send these. So thumbs up. Every thumbs up that we get for this video. Can you hear this Eminem? <laughs> Every thumbs up we get for this video goes directly to Matt Nova. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye-bye.